Of course, I'm dropping it to you already. What's up everybody? Jeremy and I are out here at Hidden Acres, just outside of Sioux City. We're not great golfers, and so the one thing that we, you know, that I've, I've realized is that we never really keep score, we never really have any kind of competition, so what better way to, to get better than to set goals, keep score, and have you guys as a witness, and just kind of create some fun content. You guys can laugh at us as we suck our way through this golf course uh, and maybe see a couple of good shots here and there. That's what we're hoping for. Um, but Jeremy, Hidden Acres, probably our favorite place to, to play. How you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good. Had a nice cup of coffee this morning. And Hidden Acres is, without a doubt, one of our favorite courses that we always like to come to. And I know from when you first moved back here to town, and this is, I believe, the first place that we actually went and golfed at. And I think it was. I, right from the get-go it was just like a flip of a switch then you just fell in love with the course and here we are again ladies and gentlemen but I mean oh, I'll come back right first first shot Hit the dirt right up here, we know that much, but it had to have bounced right into the tall stuff. Not a great first shot. We'll see if uh, I can hit a 5-iron. We're really just trying to punch this out there. On a slope, least favorite. Damn, those trees get me every time. I've got two plays, either play around the trees and risk it again, or just punch out and hope that I can get a good shot, and I think that's where I'm going with it. Taking an approach which but now give myself a better shot for next time, because I'm already behind. Basically all I could have had asked for there, get it out the fairway. Got a hold of it, but it went. Well, like I said, ladies and gentlemen, I'm thankful for not having to wind up in that. As I would have to go get some some sunscreen because I'm a I'm a friendly familiar with with uh, the sand trap, but now I'm sitting about 40 yards out. Just, Grab a 60, see if we can lay up or something. Nice shot. Hit it a tiny bit soft, but I'll still take it for landing smack on the green. All right, I think Jeremy's got a longer shot, but I'm just off the green. It did bounce right up there and roll right off. I'm kind of stuck in some crappy stuff right here. Probably should chip this out, put it. In Texas wedge. Yep, I saw that coming. Hot right off that. Oh, Jeremy's shot. Well, it played a lot softer than what I anticipated. But that's the one thing you gotta do about the golf. Let's see if we can do it. I really thought that broke more. What? Yeah, it looks like it breaks left a lot. But... Yeah. And I was also trying to read with the flag as well. Bigger putting, I can just hit it. Yeah. yeah. All that practice on the practice screens, and it didn't even matter. <laughs> Skip right past it. <sighs> the oh, of course, ladies and gentlemen.
All right. So, uh, not the best start to the first hole at all. Probably, definitely worse than the first time we came out. <laughs> oh, for sure. Which is kind of crazy. But. Either that's on the back of the green or a roll. All right, ladies and gentlemen, after the first hole, Josh is trying to bounce back after a unprecedented score of an eight. Yeah, I had a drop. That wasn't that wasn't nice. No, it was not. Hoping, hoping that I could get the game going. First hole, though, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, I topped the heck out of that. That was not good. We're switching bodies today. Terrible shot. The first shot was not good. I'm usually good on this hole, and then Jeremy's usually the one landing here, but we're switching today. Just gonna try to bounce this up, hopefully land on the green, get up and down. Oh, that was too soft. Need to play it uphill. All right, chipping game has been off and on so far, so we'll see what I can do here. I really need to get this really close to the cup. Sit, sit. A little, a little further than I thought. It's alright. Can't be mad with that. Well, even with as big of a green as it is, I still managed to bounce off. But thankfully it's not too thick of stuff where it's not going to be aggravating. But. You got to be happy with that strike oh, though I'm, from I'm the tee box. Yeah, I'm thrilled. Well, like you said, it's, we're switching today. Usually it's me that's struggling. It rolls downhill fast. It's a little faster than what I wanted it to be, but I thought that was or that is a turkey over there. <laughs> I thought it was maybe a goose. But uphill pot. I cannot read these greens today. I feel like I putt best whenever I play like a stripper. Strip the glove. Alright, I'm gonna try not to think too much and just putt. See what I can do here. This is for a boat. Oh! Right next to the hole. He's really rolled downhill, then. It? it does. Oh, dear. Almost from there. Right back the hole. Like I said, I usually, I usually struggle with this hole, ladies and gentlemen. But we're we switch bodies overnight. I'm playing better than I usually am, and Josh is playing like me. <laughs> usually not that great, but hey, that's why we. That's why we said at the top of the hour, we knew that this golfing game and everything was going to be going to be fun. It's going to be a laugh. We're not we're not anything like what you see on the PGA Tour. We're out here just to have a good time. Then. There we go. That's a beautiful shot. That should be just over those trees. Ooh, I'm talking the hell out of that. Literally playing. Kept the low. Low line stinger. All right, Jeremy outdrove my second shot, even. So I really need to get this on the green. That five iron was not beautiful, but not terrible. I'll take it. Just need to get this up and on. Get 
right. Nice bounce down the hill. Yeah, I aimed a little too far left. I was hoping for a bounce onto the green, but not quite what I was going for. Oh, just off the green. Barely. All right, shot number four. So I need to pull this out, get myself a car. Although I do have a little bit of luck because Jeremy's barely rolled off over there. So that was a little bit of luck on my end. Uh, getting this kind of nice and soft. I probably play this back of my stance. Get in. Oh. Ran out of gas. I will take that. I will take that. That's that's all I needed for a bogey. That's still a tricky putt. Well, that one's good. We're gonna have to come up here and check what our score, total score is, but I have to be happy with the bogey after double bogeying and putting up a snowman. So, first two holes, not in my favor. Second hole, or third hole, a little better. We'll see what we can do here for hole number four. That might be just right. This hole always plays longer until we play it longer. Let's see what we got. Kept it low. Oh my gosh, that was terrible. That was a horrible shot. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Josh is off to. I don't know if the coffee hasn't kicked in yet, but Josh is off to a rough start. That's why when we were up at the clubhouse, we we looked at each other. Do we want to play nine today? Do we want to play 18? But we always say, let's see how the first nine goes, and then we can kind of see how the rest of the day goes. But of course, Josh is going to be. This is one of those days I may just want to play another nine just because I'm doing so terrible. <laughs> But this is easy up there. I get lucky with that bounce on the front of the hill, but I can definitely. A little bit of a downhill slump. I had a good shot off the box, but just got a. That was a really weird kick. That's like a weird bounce. But it's on the green. I'll take it. Looky here. Chipping game is doing much better than it has been, so. Gotta be at least happy for that. Gotta take the wins where we can get a Put it straight, but I feel like it's gonna kick back left. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me.
hey, I'll take anything at this point. But that's the fun thing about golf. Never expect the unexpected. There it is. There it is. Come on, drive though. I'm going to let you straight. Kicked right a little bit. Yeah, it's got a hill. This is a shot that I am not usually good at, and it's on a little bit of a slope on like this hard ground. Using a 60, trying to get it just up and down from here. I need to get something good going. Well, after that hellacious drive, off the first two I should say, clear my mind, grab the 60 again. Man, just rolled off onto the fringe. What? All right, a little easier chip than being on the hill and everything, so I should be able to get this one up and down from here would give me a par. This was, I, I debated on chipping a bow with this stuff. I guess it takes a I didn't see that breaking right. I did not either. I thought it was going to break down. Based on the way that Jeremy's broke, I'm going to try to take it a little up. No break at all. Yes. Oh my gosh, now it wants to break on me. This is frustrating. It broke like <laughs> Yeah. So I should have had a bogey. I ended up with a double. All right, so after four, let's see, after five, Jeremy is up by four. This is not looking good for me. This is by far the worst I have played so far this year, which is saying a lot. <laughs> it's saying quite a bit, but uh, it's the best that Jeremy's playing. So I'm, I'm having fun watching him like really progress in the way he's been playing.